This is the Wirecast <laughs> gear. The Wirecast gear is built like a tank. I love this product of all the uh, appliances that are out there. This one's got what I feel is the best component level products in it. The components in it are top notch. You're getting, you know, a, a, a Xeon processor. You're getting the memory that goes in. It's this workstation server class hardware in there. And I really love that switcher mixer. So I know it's a, a product we talked about a little bit earlier in the show, but talk to me a little bit about what you think makes Wirecast gear so exciting. Well, you know, we have a lot of people that, especially now, I think, that don't necessarily know much about live video or about configuring a, a station or a workstation for live video. And so this answers all the questions for them. So there's a lot to configure when you set up a live streaming system. You know, you have to think about capture cards. You have to think about GPU and processing power. How are you bringing your cameras in? Are they SDI? Are they HDMI? What do you, NDI? Uh, so Wirecast gear is purpose built for live streaming and it comes with Wirecast Pro installed on it. We have three different versions. So there's an HDMI version, and then there's two H, uh, sorry, two SDI versions. Each of them have four inputs, either HDMI or SDI. And um, yeah, it's it's a great, powerful system built for live streaming. Yeah. So we have the Gear 310, which gives you four HDMI in and out, in and outputs, which is inputs, which is 59.95. The 320 which is for SDI, which is $69.95. Then we have the Gear 420, which is $89.95. And I want to talk about that one a little bit because that's more than just I.O. In addition to the five SDI capture and the program output, we're getting something else really cool, which is NVIDIA Quadra Discrete Graphics. Talk about why that's so important to be in this box. Yeah, when you're doing live streaming, there's a lot of processing power and a lot of GPU power that's needed. And so when you have the discrete graphics, it just, it makes everything run smoother. Um, and that NVIDIA thing allows you to have um, four outputs at the same time, which is phenomenal. And then with the wireless four, you get one uh, program output through uh, the Blackmagic card as well. So you get four inputs, you get to stream out, and then you also get a program output as well. Cool, and then one of the things I like to tell people about the box is because you've got those heavy duty Quadro graphics in it, it is a killer Adobe Premiere Pro setup. So I, a lot of my customers are using this box not just for their streaming, but like a church, they're streaming on Sunday, and then during the week they're using the same uh, Wirecast gear for their NLE. They put Adobe on it. They're running Adobe, which is great. It's not like something we get restricted or anything. We love that. And it's a it's an right. Adobe powerhouse for editing Adobe. So I like to tell for a school, a small school, or a corporation who's getting started with this one box, I could do my nonlinear editing and my live production and my post production. One of the things that we've learned is there's a hell of a lot of nonlinear editing involved in before the show, bringing clips in, editing clips, putting clips together, and there's nonlinear editing after the show because our show today is going to run 25, 30 minutes, but you know we're going to be showing two minute and five minute highlight films from it, and that you make by video editing. So I think it's a great box that's so versatile. I got to compliment you guys on just doing a great job with that. Thank you for watching this highlight from the Video Guys Live webinar. If you like this video or you want to learn more, check out the full webinar in our description or head on over to videoguys.com for more information.